Okay, there was a, a, a consideration here for, for what type of car should be used for, for a championship um, in this part of the world. And a lot of people would, would say to you that we need to be uh, using a carbon chassis because um, from the outside people would assume that it's safer and stronger. Uh, well actually that, that's changing uh, with, with modern techniques for building a space frame chassis like we have. For the first time this year the FIA are actually recognising a space frame chassis in terms of its safety standards and putting it alongside um, crash testing that's done with a carbon fibre chassis. Uh, in fact, next year Formula Ford in the UK is going to an FIA approved chassis and that is a steel space frame chassis. Uh, the chassis we have here is, is based on that exact design uh, being built by Ralph Furman who used to own Van Diemen. Uh, he, he was a leader in, in space frame chassis design and of course safety and he put a lot of uh, young drivers through, through his chassis. Um, the chassis uh, has a very typical single seater uh, suspension design, um, inboard dampers, uh, which for our championship are, are actually fixed uh, for their setup. We, we decided that um, the focus of, a, of a, a junior series should be on the driver and their uh, driving ability and development. Um, so we wanted to limit the amount of changes that can be made on the car. Uh, this, this is also practiced in other junior formulas, uh, Formula Palm Rowdy for example, uh, adopt the same, the same principle. Um, the, the steering column uh, is, is spec, FIA spec collapsible steering column um, in, in case of an accident uh, and there's also a front, frontal area crash box um, around the feet. Uh, the high sided driver head protection is spec FIA um, dimensions also to, to help in a, in a side impact. Um, accident.